I have a demonstration of damped oscillations here. I have a motion encoder cart connected with two weak springs on an encoder track, and a receiver here is going to get the position signal from the cart. I'm going to do this with two damping sails. One is weighs 210 grams, the other weighs 32 grams, so I'm going to have to add weights to, to make up for the, the weight of the sails. So let me start first of all with the large sail. I'll put this in here and create a lot of friction with the air. I'm going to displace this cart from equilibrium, hit the record key, and then release. There's the damped, decayed oscillation. And the cart slowly goes back to equilibrium. Now I'm going to remove the large air damper and I'm going to put in a smaller air damper and to make up for the difference in mass I'm going to add some weights here. Here's 180 grams. Now I'm going to tell the program to save that data set. I'm going to displace the cart from equilibrium, hit the record button and release. And here we see that the period of oscillation is the same, but the damping constant is now different. There's less damping, and it oscillates for a slightly longer time before it comes to rest at the final equilibrium position. Okay, I'm gonna remove the medium-sized damper and remove these weights. Now I'm going to add 210 grams and I'm going to tell it to save this data set and I'm going to displace the cart with the mass from equilibrium and record. And here we have much less damping and a longer damping decay constant. 